Hello and welcome to the first tutorial in our UE5 game series. Um, this will be creating a voxel-based game in the UE5 editor, which you'll see I am using the early access version as it's still brand new. Wanted to bring you guys some of the first tutorials for UE5 uh, that will help you get started. So in this video, first we're going to install our voxel plugin which currently is only available for UE4, um, at least through the UE Marketplace. So I'm gonna show you how to manually install that plugin into the UE5 interface uh, so that we can use it for our project, since a lot of this project will be based around use of that plugin. So first thing we're gonna do is uh, launch UE5, and we're gonna create a new project with this. So we're going to create a new game, and for the purposes of this video, I'm going to call this project tutorial. And uh, we're going to have a target platform and desktop, and I like to keep the quality at maximum. And I in the future with this project, I also am choosing to use a blank project as well. So we can go ahead and create this project. It'll take a little bit of time for this to initialize. Uh, if it's the first project you've created in UE5, it'll probably take significantly longer than it just took me. So once we're in here, similar to template. Now what we're gonna do is one of our first things is we want to add the Voxel plugin, which currently is limited to UE4 in the marketplace. So what we're going to do is we're going to minimize this and we're going to go to the GitHub page of the Voxel plugin. Here, if we scroll down, uh, we can go to this portion where it says download the plugin for your engine version here. We click that link and there's the Voxel free full 5.0 EA for the 5.0 early access. I expect that as new versions become available, they will continue to update this. So we're gonna right click and download that. Once we have that, we're gonna open up the, track this file. I'll just do it to the desktop. All right, and now that that's done, we have the voxel free folder on our desktop. Now let's go back into Unreal Engine and let's close out of this project. We did want to start the project initially in order to create the project folders, which we're going to need to install the plugin in. So on your computer, you're going to open the location of your uh, project. And for, I believe it defaults to documents, Unreal projects, and then the name of your project. In this folder, we're going to create a new folder and we're going to call it plugins. It has to be created with a capital P as this is the format that Unreal Engine recognizes. We're going to drag our voxel free folder into there and then we're going to reopen our project. As we do this, it's going to recognize the new folders and import that into our project. Now that we've done that, if we go to content drawer, we can see that we have this new folder with the Vox voxel plugin information. In order to test that this is working properly, let's delete this floor and let's uh, search for voxel world. 
and let's drag that into the scene. Let's reset the location of that to 000. And then let's save the project. And we can keep this world as a new map. And go ahead and play to test. Okay, you should see the same thing that I do right now. Something else we can do is in the voxel preview settings, we can hit toggle and it'll show the world in our preview. If we go to the top and activate voxel editing mode with this icon here, we should be given some new tools. And if you use those tools and click around, you should be able to edit the terrain. Assuming that you're able to do that, then you have successfully installed the Voxel plugin in Unreal Engine 5.